Hi, my name's Sarah Watts. I'm a PhD researcher at the University of Stirling and my research topic is called Improving Outcomes in Montane Woodland Restoration. So my research involves developing conservation management actions to help restore the natural altitudinal tree line to Britain. And I'm also a plant ecologist and botanist, so with a particular interest in uh, the impacts of climate change on Arctic alpine plants, uh, because I worked as a, an ecologist monitoring populations of some of our rarest Arctic alpine plants for several years prior to starting my PhD. So I got interested in STEM just by really watching natural history documentaries as a child. I quite enjoyed biology, chemistry and geography at school, so I thought ecological sciences were something that would combine all those together. I think it's quite nice to point out actually that I don't really have a particularly impressive backstory in my route into science. Um, you know, I didn't like spend my whole childhood carrying out chemistry experiments in my garage or doing my own research projects as a child or spending all my time immersed in nature. You know, it was just really a kind of interest that then developed into something more. So my advice for women thinking of going into STEM is find something that you're really enthusiastic about. So enthusiasm I think is one of the most important characteristics you can have as a scientist because it gives you intrinsic motivation to carry out your research but also a passion to communicate your findings to others. And don't be afraid to champion yourself and your skills. So if you find something that you're really excited about, that you're really good at, no matter how small it seems, then don't be afraid to tell the world about it because it's a really good way of building confidence in yourself